Hi guys and welcome back to our let's play of Pine. <coughs> we had just talked to these guys. Yes. And they told us something. Ah yeah, we had to, to make friends with all the villages and investigate the, surround, uh, the events surrounding the blunder. Like it's written up there. Let's see. Rob's workshop. Rob has decided to help you out with improving your pouch to carry items. Ah, okay. That's that one. Obtaining another outfinding might be key to convincing the humans to show a bit more initiative in finding a new home. Besides the vaults, besides the vaults can answer more questions about the steps the humans about the steps the humans before you took. The tumbers hold the access to the vaults, which were closed after the other tribes decided it's not great that the human is rummaging around in them. But the tumbers won't help you for nothing. You'll have to help them wrap up their research on the event called the blunder. Uh, what is this? Interact. The litters. A simple fault, but folk but phenomenal or phenomenal phenomenal at organizing they say that the litters have hidden all their information related to the blunder away with an ancient king deep inside the large cavern they originate from you might have found its entrance already but the secret to finding the information lies a bit deeper. Apparently you need to be in a certain state through a resource called Trulica. We haven't found it yet, but there's a monument near the litter cave that should tell you how to get the king's secret ways of getting it. How to get the king's secret ways of getting it? For some reason they left a trail of spitter, spistel sockets near it to find the monument. Bonkers, but that's how they are. <coughs> Follow the trail and you will and you'll get the information soon enough. Good luck. Rolls gold. Find the trail of spistel sockets in the sparse fields. Is that the cave? Okay. Which one is this the one about the terribly? Because that's the ones I'm friends with. The Fexels, masters of alchemy, but even more so of thievery. Very pleasant to converse with, but you have to be careful with every sentence. Legends has it that they arrived on Albemarle on beautifully crafted boats a very long time ago. They were in search of a place to safely work on their bombs, explosions and alchemy. The large crater you see in their capital village is the result of their nearly of their early early experiments. Haha. <laughs> Your best way to get in information is through a business partner of yours. Someone we barely trust, but can get the job done. Schnuski. Find that little fella, but be careful. If they do get to hustle you, remember this. Let them bet on something. And they listen. Snushki's bet. Oh, we have to become neutral or friendly with the axles. 
Where is that? Yeah, maybe we have to become friendly first. The Gobbledew are a tough folk to confer with. They dawn from the warm shades in the dunes, evolved from an older species after losing the ability to fly. They have always treated us Tambas as low class inhabitants of Albamer and anyone else for that matter. Their arrogance makes them mostly unapproachable. This is a shame as they are knowledgeable and have the strongest historical preservation of all. Yu Yu might be the perfect candidate to approach them. You are new and interesting and more importantly you can still pretend to be someone else. Something that hasn't worked for us Tambas. Craft this pearl necklace and present yourself at the Gobbledew capital as a human prince. This will make them talk to you. A prince? What's that? Just use the words. I'm sure it'll be fine. Go now. Okay. Present yourself with the pearl necklace gift to a Gobbledew chief. Where is that capital? I don't even know. I think it's in the desert. What's that symbol there? Okay, so we are getting a lot of missions here. Crocus, to be honest, Crocus, to be honest, they scare the living puffle out of us Tambas. They demand respect with their enormous posture and aggressive behavior. This species has grown into the impressive beast they are, all from the comfort of their humid shores. They are proud to be warriors and have a famous initiation process for young crockers too. Us Tambas have not been able to get far with them, apart from trivial training. Luckily there is one ancient crocker shaman who we have been able to converse with, as he values knowledge, albeit of the more supernatural kind. It's important that you perform the initiation ritual, which you do by taking and showing the High Shaman some blood berries from the initiation cave. The old crocker resides in one of the towers in the soggy woodlands. I shall mark both on your map. Good luck. <coughs> Well, I only see one. Over here. But that's okay. We will see about that. And now... The caribou, yes? Yeah. The caribouins are a strong, proud folk from the cold mountains. One of the older species on this island. Unfortunately, they know that too. They always attempt to teach everyone a lesson. The Tambas can't stand it, but I managed to bond with the exiled Caribli, Sage, Brenier, who lives in the mountains. In attempts to retrieve information, Brenier usually says that the, the answers will come in due time, which is highly aggravating. Perhaps you, you have more patience than we do. The sage seems to know everything about the history, but hasn't let go of it yet. 
He seems to want to appear very wise, but does not always succeed in doing so. Please go see Brenya. I'll mark his house on your map. Old reunion. Okay. So, a lot of missions. Where's Brenya's house? That's Brenya's house, probably. Okay. So, lots of stuff to do. Sparse fields. Is this the cave they talked about? Maybe it is. So we need to do a lot of stuff. Let's see our goals. Thrall's gold. The litters are simple but organized folk. It is said that the ancient king Thrall had a lot of secret techniques that make the litters thrive. Finding the tomb might be the best way, the best way to start. Access to the vault with very close uh, tribes decided it's not a great idea, okay. The trial of the warrior, a cold reunion. Sage Brenia. The tomb gazer. Being great at preservation because they are so proud it might be one of the more important parts of knowledge about the blunder that needs to be filled. The cobbled you. Snushki's bed. Snushki is found walking around in one of their villages. Maybe this one first. Let's see. Is this the one? Yes, that's the one. Okay. Um, what was the recipe for the necklace? This is the necklace. Puffle feather, slick pearl and stiff rope. Oh. I have everything I need, only the puffle feathers I don't have. So if I find some I will get them. So now we go up there to the Caribbean sage and see what he has to say. Since we are friendly with the Cariblis, I guess that's a good start. <coughs> Let's save after all this talking. Don't want to have to repeat that. Um, 24, 24, so 21st. Okay. Damn it, our inventory is still full. We have a lot of these things here. Mm -hmm. We have to start eating some stuff we don't have a lot of. Maybe these currants. Is a village right here? Yeah, it is. What kind of a village? Oh, Vexel village. Okay. <laughs> oh, nice. Is it marked on my map? Yes, it is. Okay.
Oh, there are some crackers down there. The ridge. I just discovered the ridge. Oh, okay, that's all of this part. There's another village, and here's a crocker village, yes. Okay. Whose village is that over there? It looks like the one down here. So maybe it's Vexel also. Vexel, not Vexel, Vexel. <coughs> Let's see what's that up there. It's no village, I guess. Are there any blue balls up here? What are they called? Ampiscus? Ampiscus orbs? Mm, this looks like a puzzle spot. Garment, grass bone, pin required. Okay. Mechanical lever required. Hmm. Okay. So I guess we can't do this yet. There's another target down there. Hm, okay. We will have to come back to here. Maybe mark this on the map? Ah, then it always shows that it's, it's annoying. Hmm. Oh, there's a blue ball and we don't seem to be able to get over there. So let's get down here. And see if we can get this one without too much trouble. Yeah, just sitting here. Is there a cave? No. no. This looked like it. How many do we have? Oh, that's another Vexel village. We have 14 now. Yeah, we have to get through this. What's that? Rich banks. Just run through without giving it too much to pick on us about. Uh, this doesn't look very safe. Can we just walk over it? Yes, nice. What is this? Another puzzle? No, it doesn't look like it. Norton Plateaus. Oh, there's some guys coming. Ah, that's terribly nice. There's a lot of torches on here. And there's something big. Ah, that's the place where I'm going. So maybe this is the Caribbean capital?
Any blue spheres? Doesn't look like it from here. Yeah, I'm going to that place over there, and this seems to be the Caribbean capital. <coughs> Since they are a mountain folk. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I would... I would think that this could be their capital. Oh, but there are some crocs there also. Uh. Oh, okay. Now oh, let's get some feathers. No feathers here? Only if I kill them. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. I need a feather. Ah, damn it, pouch full. Um, let's see, I probably need to eat, yes? Can I now take it? Nope. One more. Yes. Now let's craft this thing, so we have it already. Okay. Hmm, not my taste. I wouldn't even give this to Marwa. I hope Est has thought this through. Yeah, here's another big puzzle. But we need this electrical stuff. I still don't know how that works. <coughs> but let's go down here and talk to that guy. Ooh, solve for it. Solve, solve for it. Nice. What's this trader token? Rich fennel and. Watchful. Oh, seems they kicked that croc's butt. Mm. Hi guys, let's see what we have to trade. I have way too much stuff on me. I need to get rid of some stuff. Oh, you don't have a lot of resources. So that's a good good thing for me, I suppose. Do you talk, dude? No, you don't. You are at war with... Only with those little guys with the litters. Nice. You, let's see what you have for me. Nice, you have these. And these that I want. What's this? A new reward mushroom. Traditionally eaten by slimy creatures only, now widely found around the soggy areas of Albemarle. Nutritious vegetable growing on rich mountains in the area. Okay. Let's see, what can I sell you? This stuff. This stuff. Um... You needed some food, yes? You like this stuff, yeah? Think flower, you like this one. Okay. Take this, take some bones, take a feather. Um, what else can I sell you? Dental bacteria of larger species and critters found in the woodlands areas. This ones we can sell this stuff. Um... What else? This seems to be pretty rare. This also. Yeah, I don't want to sell anything else. 
So confirm trade. Can't wait to look about what you brought. Let the chief know. Okay. Burial coast. Okay, that's this up here. There's another village, supposedly. So now you have more stuff. Yeah, now you have a lot of food. No materials, you have a lot of food, not really. But okay, this should keep you going for some time. There's the sage cabin. Oh yeah, they are level 2 now. Or maybe they were before and I just didn't recognize it. No blue... Viscous orbs or something around here. Hm, shame. Probably around the sage's house. I would suspect. Let's get around here first. Let's see, nothing there. Maybe behind there. So, let's throw down a save here. And I will make a cut. Hope you guys enjoyed. Come back for more to see the rest of the story unfold. And see you soon. Bye.